Now, if you're anything like me, you might have a preference for a very dark interface when it comes to AutoCAD. I've gotten really used to the black background, although it's not quite black, and I've gotten really used to all the dark ribbons. But for those of you who are potentially coming from a different software and find this to be really harsh, uh, which it is, it definitely looks different than most typical kind of softwares that you might be experiencing with, um, you might want to make some adjustments. And helpfully, AutoCAD does make it where you can customize your interface where you don't have to look at gray, black, and dark gray all the time. So to adjust your interface where you have a little bit of a lighter view, all you have to do is go to the A menu, go to options, then on the display tab, you can change first your color scheme to light, and that's actually going to change all of your bars to this lovely kind of lighter gray, which again, if that's something that you're more used to, it can help it make it feel like some more familiar softwares. But that doesn't change the background of model space. So instead, you might go click here, colors, and here's where you change your background. Now, as you can see, the actual color that it's set isn't actually black. It's just a really, really dark color. And it can be helpful to make it where you're not straining your eyes looking at a bright white screen all the time. And I would actually recommend not ever going full-blown white because it can just be really difficult to look at that for hours on end. And sometimes that's going to be how you're looking at AutoCAD. So instead, you might go into select color, go to true color and let's see you know it could be a really faint kind of violet or faint blue and that can be lighter but just a bit more gentler so I click OK and suddenly I have all of these different things going on I can turn off my grid and I can still see all my lines now it may be that some of your layers, if you have them set up in different colors, that they're not going to be as easily visible on your new background. And that could be something to keep in mind as well, that a lot of times when you have different colors, they are going to be a good contrast on that dark background. Whereas if you have a lighter background, then you might need to change some of those colors. But overall, this can be a nice way for you to brighten up your AutoCAD interface if you would like it to look a little bit more similar to some of the other programs you work in. Of course, if you accidentally do this and want to change it back, all you have to do is go to A, Options, change it back to Dark, Colors, and go back to that original color, 33, 40, 48, and apply and close, okay. And there you have it, back to normal. If you liked that video, check these out and click to subscribe where you'll be the first to see new videos I release every Monday. Thanks for watching.